Watch you guys, got another video here for you. Uh, on the forums, or my forums, we have uh, How to Automate Disk Part by Mike. He wants to know how to automate it. And you can also make a USB stick bootable by doing it this way as well. And you can see he wants to uh, do this here. And uh, it's pretty straightforward and easy to, easy to do. I have posted up stuff on here about it. And he's also created another post there's also a piece of code you can use to uh, run as administrator if you add this code in above your uh, actual script that you're running this will then uh, try to run that as administrator rather than you right clicking on as administrator you can just click on it okay so you need to add this code uh, above your code it all self-explanatory on here uh, to do and that's uh, even green that's uh, made that code available so also on here, if you've got any video requests like uh, Mike, you can also go to my forums and there is a section on here called YouTube video uh, request and you just go on here and post up your requests and I'll do my best to make those videos for you. Anyway, so let's get started here. So you can see I've got a USB flash drive plugged in right here and uh, you need to find out what drive letter this is, okay? and you can do that in uh, this part it's pretty straightforward so let me just quickly show you cmd and then run this as administrator and you just go disk part once that opens up you can go this disk okay this disks oh this disk there we go and that will give you your uh, disks on there. Okay, and you can see we have our 32 gigabyte disk two. So from there, we're gonna go into our C root directory. I've got two files inside here, and you can see disk part uh, dot text. You can call these whatever you like, as long as they're in the same uh, directory, and uh, USB, bootable USB, whatever you wanna call them. Uh, but we've got this as disk part and you can see here the text has got select disk 2 and that's because that's the disk that I want to change and you can see here it's going to clean it and also it's going to create a partition primary select partition 1 active uh, format quick assign a letter E and you can change this to whatever you like whether you want to change the drive letter you can do and also exit and uh, on the command side of things the script you can see here we've just got a at echo off uh, disk part space forward slash s and then c colon backslash disk part dot text that's just pointing to that location to read that file it's that simple and uh, once you've done that you should be pretty much go now if you want to add other stuff in you can do if you want to run this as administrator you would have to put that code which we talked about above this uh, at echo off okay that's the first script to run which would be your administrator and then this okay so that's pretty self-explanatory now obviously uh, once you've done this you're pretty much good to go from here so let me just go here and uh, I'll put just a quick text file in there just to show it is working and uh, you see it all format it and everything else okay so this is on the USB drive and to automate that we're just going to run it so here we go we're going to run this file now i'm going to right click on this and run this as administrator say yes and there we go it's that quick it's done it already and if i go back here you'll see it's all clean it's been formatted and it's got ready now if you want to make these bootable you can do and you can also copy files across by doing uh commands and batch files and stuff like that if you want to uh, if you wanted to do that uh, the way I showed you on the forums as well. So anyway, that's pretty much it. Just a quick video just to show you how to automate uh, this part. That's what they wanted to see. And that's uh, how you can do it. Anyway, I hope this one helps you out. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Remember, guys, uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button. And also, if you've got any video requests, you can always head over to the forums. Join up over there. It's free to join. And also post up uh, some content on there if you want to and help out. Anyway. Have a great weekend. I shall see you again for another video real soon. Bye for now.
Now if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the big red subscribe button on my YouTube channel and hit the bell notification button next to that to be notified when we upload new videos.